A student protest got out of hand inside West Bend High School today. Police had to calm things down. Julia Fellow joins us live with that story. Julia. And Mike and Carol, this all started in the East Cafeteria behind me as a peaceful sit-in protest this morning. It ended with 90 students, about 90 students being interviewed by police. And now many students tell me they're embarrassed about what happened. I think it's completely immature. I just heard people swearing and screaming out in the hallways. They were just running around being crazy. Now the school officials are left cleaning up the mess with torn posters in the hallways and wet bathroom floors after a mob of students left the faucets running. The West Bend superintendent shows us how it was all over the new bigger hall passes. This is how big it is. It's half a sheet of paper clipped to a lanyard so that it can't be lost. It says, you know, it would say like Mr. Knightsky, U.S. History, room 212. It's this big. A campaign against it started online. This morning, about 300 students gathered in the cafeteria, trying to explain to the principal why they felt like they were being treated like children. That's when about 100 of them walked to the field house, causing the mess and the lockdown. One female student was arrested for disorderly conduct. Parents we spoke to wish this was all handled better. Yes, they don't need to see this. They're minors. I mean, this is way out of control. The school should handle it better. In retrospect, do I wish I would have had more people there this morning? Yes. But based upon the plan that was put in place by the school administration, the fact that we knew this meeting was taking place, I mean, they've had other assemblies or other meetings with students that have been upset, and, you know, there hasn't been uh, this, this type of response. And the superintendent says that he hopes that more students will air out their issues through letters that he will read. He says dozens of them have already aired out their issues and grievances, and many of them have apologized over what happened this morning, over their grievances, over these larger hall passes that will take effect very soon. Reporting live in West Bend, Julia Fellow, today's TMJ4. Yeah, school day got up, disrupted up there today. Thanks, Julia.